Dave. Yeah, it's Rocco. Weight boxing today, 3 p.m. Don't be late. Let's do this. What's up? It's Rocco, Rocks Burbage. Dave AV really has got it coming for him this time. You better watch out because I'm going to hit him with some hard hitters. Just hope you don't hit me with any, anything to do with that beard, really. Buried alive by the lies and they sold. They stride of a blind man's stroll. But for whom does the next bell toll? Dave, you've got no idea of what this is about to come out. Too many years to have built what I own. You don't want to say no more than a mum you can't so, afford. Dave the Chopper AV here. Been uh, trying some alternative uh, forms of training, which I think has really helped me. And uh, I'd say he's going down in the first round, to be honest. I can't see any way that he's going to last. And you don't want that recognition of the that guy. Fuck off, Burbage! No, you're not it! Okay, boys. Before the fight starts, we're going to speak some ground rules, okay? The fight starts on the jeepney. You get six rounds, three rounds of each glove. It's going to be a clean fight. You want no spitting, no shinning, and no biting. Yeah. But other than that, boys, anything goes. Best of luck to you both. Let's have a clean fight. Yeah. Ooh. All right, Dave. Are you going to be zipping your life jacket up for this one? Dude, safety first. Always important. We finally made him do it. The life jacket is up. The other tactic I'm going to be using is... Uh, Punching him in the face. Oh! oh! <laughs> this is your second fight of the trip. We saw you fight against Ryan in the PP Islands in that boxing ring. How are you feeling coming into this fight? Yeah, definitely a different kettle of fish. That one was obviously in the ring. This one's on the cable. Obviously, uh, Dave, being the little angry man he is, a little bit worried about him. So we'll see what we can do. I've got to start with my left hand, which I don't like because that's obviously my weaker hand. But get into round four, five, and six. Get the right hand going and see what we can do there. Good luck, boy. Yeah. We're about to do our fight predictions. Liam, who do you think? They're, they're standing right there. You can't be too loud about it. I, I don't know. I know Dave's got that little little aggression in him. When I was, when I was filming Dave's skit, he did this like crazy roar. And honestly, I've never seen anger like it. That man, do you see his veins popping up? Yeah! I know Rocco's got the reach on him, but Dave's got the anger, and I think if Rocco releases that, then who knows? But then again, Rocco did take you in the fight. Hello, darkness. That's still debatable, Liam. That's still a sore <laughs> subject as well, so. Yes, we're about to get underway with the fight. Both the boys are ready. Let's not delay this any longer. Let's get going with the fight. So we are classing that as a knockdown. That was not a knockout at all. And Rocco actually broke one of the gray area rules of going underneath the guy on the inside. So when you're on the outside, you do have that upper hand and he shouldn't have gone underneath Dave there. So that is classed as a knockdown and not a knockout. So we will be continuing with round three. Let's continue the fight. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
It's still only a knockdown. Jesus Christ, that's a double knockdown. Two in one go. <laughs> we, we still need round four. Oh my God, well, we've got to change sides, really, haven't we? Yeah, yeah, change sides, round four. Christ, that was bad. <laughs> Rocco went on top of Dave. Did you see when Dave came up? He was like, yeah. <laughs> Come on boys, stay on your feet! Where's the stamina? Round four, let's go, come on! We haven't trained months for this fight for nothing! <laughs> we spend months in a gym and it's the results we get! It's a joke! Well, I didn't bring you two out here to put on a shit show like this! Come on, give me a proper fight, the crowds want it! Come on! Let's swap gloves boys and have a little chat. How are we feeling? Yeah, I'll give him that one. The last one we both got each other a good uh, little punch, but he got me a little bit better on that one. Second round, just kind of got a little bit caught up, and Dave went down. First round was a little bit stalemate, really. So. And uh, Dave, how's the anger levels getting on? <laughs> All right, mate. I'm pretty chill. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm good. Um, yeah, I mean, like so far it's a breeze. I'm confidently expecting to uh, to get him down the next couple of rounds, and if not if not a points victory, then it's going to be a TKO. Guys, who's going to win the fight? Who's gonna win, do you know? Do you speak English? Yeah? Who's gonna win the fight, do you know? There was multiple knockdowns there <laughs> by both of them. Oh so God. I guess that leaves it up to you guys to decide who your winner is of match two of the wakeboard boxing series. Dave AV versus Rocco Burbage. You decide who wins, comment down below. And uh, yeah, don't forget to share this with one of your friends that you would want to fight against in wake boxing. Where should we bring the gloves next? Let us know in the comments below. We want to bring it to a cable near you. Good fight. Nice uh, clean couple of rounds at the end there. Kind of disappointed to uh, go and nose edge myself at the end after uh, what was a pretty good fight up until that point, but. Good fight on his part, man. I think, yeah, we, uh, we went blow for blow. I think you and... broke my shin, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> What an action-packed fight that was indeed. Some pretty hard hits from both contenders. Make sure to let us know down in the comments who you thought is deserving of the win. It was pretty much what I thought was a very equal fight. But yes, let us know in the comments. Don't forget to drop this video a like and don't forget to subscribe. And we will see you guys in the next video. Yo!